Well, hey, everybody out there in YouTube land. This is Rick Outdoors coming to you. Saturday morning, we down here. Just got finished splitting some rounds I had put over here by this uh, wood bunker I got, trying to fill it up. But we're going to bring you a little video of me splitting it, but I got a little news for you. As far as the wood yard is concerned, me and my wife, we finally bit the bullet and we're going to get us a new tractor. You know, I've learned a lot in the last probably 10 years with old, old age creeping up on me. I have to start thinking about working smarter, not harder. And my old tractor, it's still Cadillac, it's still working, but I could use one with quick, quick couplings on the front, a gravel system to help move these big chunks around. My tractor's got the little narrow tires on it. I want the ag tires. So I put a little short up the other day and I'll try to remember to include a, a video of my uh, picture of my wife sitting on the tractor. We're gonna get us a Kubota. My cousin works for Kubota and dealership uh, in Newberry. I'm friends with him. The owner I went to school with, he went to a different high school I did, but we knew each other. So I finally, we went today. Yesterday was my girl Rosie's 10th birthday. Today is my wife's birthday. And tomorrow is our anniversary, 12 years anniversary. We've been together 17 years, been married 12. And we were on our way to Columbia to take her shopping. She wanted, uh, she got planner and I know I'm going to say this wrong, plantar fasciitis, which I do too. And I went to a tennis shoe store years ago and got fitted for one, and it really helped me. And she started having a problem with her. So we was going to go down that day and get her fitted, get her a pair of tennis shoes. But I got about three miles from the house going toward the city, and a pine straw guy called me. He's bringing me a big load of pine straw, so I had to turn around. But our daughter, we asked her to go, so they've gone to Columbia to do some shopping. I already done my shopping. Hopefully, the tractor's getting built. Not getting built, but it's it's gonna have a third function on it: the water tires, the bucket, and the gravel on it. And I'm gonna get a set of forks for it. I'm probably missing something else, but we worked hard for it. We deserve it. I might not need it as much as I did 10 years ago, but I'm be 62 this year. I gotta start taking care of this body a little bit better. That's what my wife's tell me. Everybody else does too, but we're gonna enjoy it. Hope to get it middle of next week. We'll bring a video on it. But I hope everybody's doing well. It is overcast here. It is humid. But it's in the mid 70s. It's supposed to get up to 80 degrees a day, but it's it looks like it could rain. We had two inches of rain here in the last two days. Hadn't been in the wood yard. But we're going to bring you this little bit of video. Hope you enjoy it. Rosie, you got anything you want to say? We appreciate the prayers too on Rosie. We uh, hadn't mentioned this, but she hadn't been feeling that good. And we took her a week ago to the vet. And I had found a knot on her rib cage. And after long and hard consideration, talking with the doctor, we're just going to bring her back home. We don't know. It could be serious, could be not serious. But if you go in there, a lot of times you go in there and you start messing and probably it can make it uh, spread faster. So she's 10 years old today. And we're just loving every day, folks. That's all you can do. Get up in the morning, hug your loved ones, hug your pets, tell them you love them, because you're not promised tomorrow. But I hope you're having a great weekend. Hope to see you back here probably Monday in the wood yard. 
We really appreciate y'all.